let us consider some strategies for transcription. Everyone has a different approach to paleography, and you will likely develop your own strategies. However, in order to develop essential skills, you should attempt to employ some systematic approaches to all transcriptions. To improve your paleography skills, you should attempt to approach each document, regardless of its readability, with specific strategies in mind. This ensures you will train your mind and eyes to work with all types of handwriting, even those that are hard to decipher. My approach to paleography is called SILREST. SILREST is an initialism, or what you might think of as an acronym. Each letter in SILREST represents one of six strategies. Briefly, these strategies are S, strategy one, scan the entire document before attempting to transcribe it. It is important for you to become familiar with how the scribe writes. Repeatedly scanning a document will help your eyes to become accustomed to the hand of the scribe. I, strategy number two, identify those letters, abbreviations, and numbers that you can immediately recognize. This is very straightforward, but it is the beginning of finding your way into the document. Finding to re easy to recognize letters will help you appreciate how much you already can see, and it will spur you along to uncover other letters and words. L, strategy number three, locate common words to A, understand how the scribe connects their letters together, and B, recognize other alphabetical letters and numbers. This strategy helps you identify letters that are hard to recognize. If you see a common word and you are flexible in terms of how it might be spelled, then you see many curious spellings of words you know. More importantly, you can find new letters using this strategy. R. Strategy number four. Recognize the abbreviations used in the document and if they vary within the document. Finding and marking your abbreviations makes your task easier because it reminds you some words on the page are not complete words at all. Rather, they are almost nonsensical connections of letters. Find the abbreviations so that your eyes and mind do not attempt to create words that do not exist on the page. S. Strategy number five, search for English-Spanish cognates, those words that share similar meanings and spellings in English and Spanish, to identify more letters and connections. Cognates are helpful because you can work backwards into reading letters on the page. For example, if you know the word might be jurisdiction in English, therefore, it might be jurisdicción in Spanish then you begin to identify hard to read letters within the word on the page. T, strategy number six, type or write your transcription and leave plenty of room to add edits. Creating a transcript will help you fill in the blanks as you work through those last hard to read letters and words. Employing these basic strategies will help you use the document to decipher itself, that is, the document becomes its own key to unlocking the manuscript.